knife and the father was still lingering. Why is he holding looking a banana? into the room and started to eat it. Is he a monkey? The slow steel. Eee, his eyes stop. never stop. Only staring. Forever staring. Okay. Hey, okay. Quick question, question, guys. Okay. If you were at your friend's house and your dad walked in like this. <laughs> but like seriously guys, what, what would you do in this situation, huh? I I you know what I would do? I wouldn't even go for the door because he's holding a banana and he's standing there. I'd go straight out the window. Bro, I'm Donkey Kong out of there. Changing our collection of Pokemon cards. The boys playing video. Luke's game. mother had a gorgeous smile, offering us a never end. Had a gorgeous smile, huh? You were so nasty, oh my god. I to give this Hold up, let me repeat that. Had a gorgeous smile! Are you ready for some spooky stories? Guys, you know it's business when I'm busting out the baby, the beautiful. Yeah! Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Malcolm here, and welcome to something a bit different. Okay, not a bit different. We've done this on the channel before, but we haven't done this in a while, I think. So, you guys remember like a long time ago when I used to do more like reaction videos, apart from just doing Friday Night Funkin'. Okay, <laughs> so uh, yeah, guys, today we're gonna react to two spooky stories because obviously that goes more into like my section with horror and Friday Night Funkin'. So, I was like, why don't we do some horror stories today? Watch some. Um, you know, be a good time. Just sit back, relax. I'm just gonna chill with you guys. We're gonna watch some scary animation. You got your snacks, your food, and whatever you else you guys eat. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's go! We have McDonald's Vintage Horror Story Animated. This one, I think this one, this one was this year. This was all the way back in February. I watched this guy quite a lot, Horror Shorts Party, and he makes some really scary, weird, creepy animation. So I was like, hey, why don't we check this guy out? I think you guys are gonna like this one. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go with this one first. And then after, I've got another one for you guys, and that one's really weird. But uh, yeah, let's watch the video. All right, guys, here we go. McDonald's the Vintage story Horror Story. around the early 2000s, back when I was still in elementary school. I was in my early teens, so the monotonous school life was something I always dreaded. My mom always picked me up from school as her workplace was just down the street, so getting a ride was always less strenuous than walking home. She would usually stop by our local- <laughs> Wait, hold up! <laughs> just wait, 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 home. why is his mom looking like his granny? <laughs> stop by our local McDonald's just before heading home as she didn't really prepare home-cooked meals due to the exhaustion of being a single mother. As much as I adored my mom, the lack of home-cooked meals and abundance of McDonald's always kept me out of shape for the latter part of my teen years. Yeah, but you don't want to go down that The one thing I found genuinely pleasing about that McDonald's was the enormous play place attached to the restaurant itself. Where? Okay, I live in the UK, so if I have any American people at home right now, comment down below because you guys know if you're from the UK, you didn't have none of this. We never had play places in McDonald's. We just had seats. <laughs> Where's our play pit? That's a tongue twister. Where's our play places? My mom usually dropped me off there to play with my neighborhood friends and acquaintances, as long as I got the majority of my schoolwork done. Yep, you're gonna get There beat. was this one occasion, that. though, that <laughs> really disturbed me to my core, and it seeps into my daily thoughts from time to time. I remember okay. being picked up from school and heading over to that same McDonald's venue to pick up some takeout for that evening. As we got inside, Why is mom so old? Usual Big Mac combo while I casually glance at the play place through the glass window of where the eating area was. Jimmy, what drink would you like? Jimmy? Son? What drink Whoa, would you like? Whoa, what's going on with his eyes? I remember zoning out at what? this particular Wait, moment. He went from a light skin to a dark skin. I remember skin. zoning out at this particular moment and could recall the echoes of my mom calling out for me. It was almost as if I couldn't move a muscle, like my entire body was in a state of shock traveling through space and time into another dimension. It felt like it was just me in the play place, like I had the entire setup all to myself. Jenny, what drink do you want? Uh, I'll get a Coke, Mom. As my mom headed back to complete the rest of the order, I could recall seeing the reflection of a Ronald oh. McDonald clown standing from a distance behind me, 
almost like he wanted my attention. I hate Ronald McDonald. I casually McDonald. pretend like I don't see him by keeping my eyes glued to the glass Why would you make a clown and not bothering to turn around. That's just gonna scare kids. I know you can see me on the reflection of the glass. Alright, Pennywise. That's when I casually turn towards the direction of the clown and say, Uh, can I help you, sir? Yes, my dear boy. Do you or your mother want to see what a pyromaniac can do with a little fire? We're just here to pick up a Big Mac, so no thanks. Maybe I can cook you a delicious giant Big Mac with my fire abilities so that you will yeah, never I need think to I'll come take to my McDonald's Big Mac and go, again. Please. Hey, leave us alone or I will call the cops. Go ahead and call them. I'll just teach my cellmates how to start a fire and make an explosion. Oh, so beautiful. <laughs> Let's get out of here, Jimmy. That's when we get inside my mom's vehicle and drive away from the McDonald's. Or should Did I say... Did he follow you? I feel like Ronald followed them. About a week after that bizarre, I'm playing Duck Hunt on my Nintendo as my computer lacked oh, the duck entertainment season. that today's modern computer has. I eventually went back to that local McDonald's as I surprisingly missed the food. Why would you go back? more importantly, the play place. As the day transitioned into the evening, my mom dropped me off there as the company <coughs> of the local teens in the neighborhood made her feel a little more comfortable doing so. I'll be back at 10 p.m. sharp. Call me if you want me to pick you up earlier, okay? Okay, Mom. I decided to call my neighbor friend Chris using the payphone located outside the McDonald's venue. Uh, hello? Hey, Chris, it's Jimmy. You still coming to McDonald's tonight? Oh, hell yeah, I'll be there in one- Oh, my- Hey there, long time no- <laughs> Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me! <laughs> you see the way I bonk <laughs> on the glass? Oh, this dude- Oh, this dude's dead. <laughs> Oh, hey there, hard. long time no see. What the hell do you want? Let me show you how I make my fire. <laughs> Get the hell away from here or I'll call the cops. Fine, have it your way then. Your little behind couldn't handle all this smoke anyway. That's when I ran inside the McDonald's and immediately made my way inside the play place. Why? W I honestly could have notified a McDonald's employee or any stranger for that matter, but... I ultimately decided to take the high road and wait it out until it was time for my mom to pick me up. This kid, I remember <laughs> making my way up through the tunnels of the playground as I just wanted to reach the very top and avoid any further encounters with any other weirdos. And there's Ronald! I eventually oh, reached the top of the platform and remember basking in the view as the array of colors from the ball pit was always something I found mm. oddly satisfying to look at. That's mm. when I noticed a familiar I actually find that size phone as well, you know, he's not lying. Pit. It was the clown. The same clown from earlier, looking up at me with his ominous smile and revolting eyes. Bro. What the hell is going on? Why isn't anyone acknowledging this freak? The clown just stood there All looking those at me as if nothing mattered besides myself and his existence. I know you can hear me up there. What the hell do you want? I killed your mother, Jimmy. Now it's only you and your stupid neighbors left. What the hell are you talking about? Jump! I'd be out of time. Hell no, leave me alone! Just leave, man! Oh, don't worry, it's totally safe, Jimmy. Now jump. No, I'm not doing it! Jump! 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 <laughs> and that's when I look to my left and see my friend Chris right next to me. Oh, he Chris got no messed choice. up! <gasps> what the hell? <laughs> Why did they have to use the bowling ball noise? Wait, ru wait, run that back, run that back, hold up. <gasps> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> now it's your turn, you little brat! Jump, 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 jump! These are jump. really. Whoa! I began to close my eyes and hyperventilate as I felt a sudden surge of adrenaline Don't jump. flowing through my body. But then I began to feel a rather odd sensation something like a fiery substance burning the hairs on the back of my neck off. That's when I open my eyes and find myself on my apartment balcony with my entire building engulfed in flames. What, what the, the hell? hell? Somebody help me! Help! I hope you all burn in hell and are uh, loving it. I hate you, Dad! <laughs> you will always it. and will forever be a clown! I hate you, you stupid, stupid clown! Help! Somebody please call 911! Help! Help me! Somebody please hey, the call 911! Help! 
Oh my goodness! <laughs> I'm turning into spaghetti real quick. Why is he crying though? Okay, you know what? Just, just get me off the screen. I don't like that laugh. All right, well that was a lovely anime. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's move on to our second one. That was a really creepy one. Alright guys, so for our next one, we have my first slumber party story time. So this one, uh, this guy actually also does a lot of animations, as you can tell. 3.03 oh, million subs, like, Meat Canyon is killing it. We're gonna watch this one. I'm pretty sure this one's really weird. This one's more, like, funny than horror, I think. So, uh, yeah, hopefully it's not as creepy as the last one, because I'm- It's- it's 9 at- it's 9 p.m. You know, when it's 9 p.m. and I gotta go bed later, I don't like watching stuff like this, I'm just doing it for the video. Alright, let's watch the second one. Hello, I'm Meat Canyon. I thought I would take a break from the parodies for a moment and tell you all a story from my life. What the hell a was little that pig up there? My book called got, like, four My eyes. First Slumber Party. My First Slumber Party. Mm. I was eight years old. Oh, the I see the Mario the Party. Sleep, and I was full of excitement for the night ahead. Me and my friend Luke had been hanging out for a couple hours, playing video games and exchanging our collection of Pokemon cards. The boys playing video Luke's games. mother had a gorgeous smile, offering us a never end. Had a gorgeous smile, huh? You were so nasty, oh my god! Gorgeous! Damn! Hold up, let me repeat that. Had a gorgeous smile! Yo, I just, I, I, I think I just take advantage of like rocking on this chair. <laughs> that is not a gorgeous smile, okay? Is that Bart Simpson on the right? It was a normal night, at least, so I thought. Time for bed. We have church in the morning. Okay, I can't with these faces. These faces are really creepy. Look at that. Oh, you ain't got no teeth. Time for bed. We have church in the morning, and we have to get up real early. An ocean of disappointment flooded over me. <laughs> I was not aware this was a part of the plan. When I think about going to heaven, it makes me just so happy. I want to go there so bad. <laughs> oh my God, I want to see my grandma and, and my grandma. Bro, eyes are about to pop out my head. My pastor says they're waiting for me. Seriously. I'll race you to my room. I'm okay. Yeah, I'll stay right he here, left please. Me there alone to traverse the darkness of his house all by myself. Standing confused, I knew I had to push forward. Oh, this I wasn't going to be the weird kid sitting alone at a friend's house. I had far too much pride. So, dude went for a sleepover. Guy said we got church tomorrow. He's like, nah. <laughs> this is a sleepover. Luke's mother was at the sink washing oh, dishes around. normally. But what caught my eye was the table. Are those Pokemon cards? <laughs> well, giving us a never-ending supply what of, is that? of bananas. Is that a... Luke's mother recklessly put the banana peels I'm all over the I don't know. Most notably, my Blaziken card, which Why I was obsessed crying? with. Because you're crying. Since he was my starter in Ruby, I caught her attention by saying, "Hey, my dad paid a lot for these cards." She approached me with her. Uh, looks like a moth. Would you like a snack before bed? I'm sorry for the tears. Mr. Roberts hasn't been acting normal lately. Why well, she sound like a man and like blood just came on the back of something, her? Ooh, but I couldn't pay any attention. From the corner of my eye, I noticed something. The hell is that sausage on the right? Bag of combination pizza rolls. <laughs> pizza roll. Which was fucked because all she offered all night was cut up bananas. <laughs> it's like, if you have pizza rolls, why not just throw a couple in the oven for your guest, let alone a child? But I digress. Hey, I'm up Fair here. Enough. Come on. Oh, bro, it's the B-Tech Bart Come Simpson on. and his Mr. dad, Breyer. who's creepy! <laughs> oh my god, whose dad is this, huh? Come, it's time for prayer before bed. Oh, they're gonna pray? Oh, oh, don't walk up in the dark. Please don't do that. Are they like reciting something? With your grace and your love. Amen. You missed our prayer. Yo! I hope you're able to sleep. Hey! You're pushing the PG limit! <laughs> Get that bulge on my face. <laughs> what is that face? <laughs> 
Oh god, no, I would not sleep beside him. I'm sleeping under the bed. I'm sleeping with the monsters. Yeah, that's why. Hey, now, do you want to play Donkey Konga? Donkey Konga? I didn't give an answer. I remained silent. Bro, it's called still. Donkey Kong. Suddenly, I was blinded by the light from Luke's TV. And there he was. Oh, it actually is Donkey Hitting Konga. the plastic bongo drums and giggling to himself. But I noticed something. I noticed that the door was still cracked. And the father was still lingering. Why is he holding a banana? Looking into the room. Right at my eyes. He pulled out a banana and started to eat it. Is he a monkey? The slow rotation of his jaw grating like steel on steel. Eee, his eyes never stop! <laughs> Only staring. Forever. Staring. Okay. Hey, okay. Quick question, question, guys. Okay. If you were at your friend's house... And your dad walked in like this. <laughs> but like seriously guys, what, what would you do in this situation, huh? I, I, you know what I would do? I wouldn't even go for the door because he's holding a banana and he's standing there. I'd go straight out the window. Bro, I'm Donkey Kong out of there. Yeah, you enjoying your banana? Ugh. Let's zoom in though. <laughs> and that's where my memory ends. And oh, I've that's always been it? fascinated with religion and the afterlife ever since then. Though it leaves a sour taste in my mouth with a hint of banana. <laughs> Take care, everyone. <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs> God damn. Okay, you know what, guys? I'm going to watch one more. I really like his animations. There's a regular show one. And there's an ad. <laughs> okay, wait. I want to watch this one, guys. All right, look at Rigby. Mordecai, what the? Oh my god! Nah, muscle man don't look that different to be honest. He down, he's down that bad for Margaret. This is what happened to him. All right, guys. So we're gonna watch. This is probably gonna be the final animation I'm gonna watch today. I, I was only gonna do two, but that one was so short. We'll just do another one. This one's called Gumballs in the Park, and uh, yeah, this one's regular show. And if you know me, I'm a very, very, extremely big fan of regular show. And I just absolutely love this show. So um, yeah, I, I couldn't. I couldn't. Dude, when we get done raking these leaves. We should go watch a movie and order a pizza. You read my mind. Looking good, boys. Looking very good indeed. Okay, guys, I don't actually watch regular show anymore. Recently, Benson has been on the news for being a nonce. <laughs> Such a good job today. Why do you look so sinister? You couldn't give yourself a little reward. Mm -mm. Right? L like the day off? Bro, are you gonna get reward from a fist a in your face? I, I don't think. Unless. Unless you both think that you haven't been doing a good job, and. And if that's the case, maybe I should. Maybe I should just let you go. <coughs> Please let me go. I hate to fire you, because. In my eyes, you both have been doing so well. We've been trying our best. <laughs> Jolly good show. <laughs> <laughs> Bro! Pops, what happened to you? Why is his neck looking like he's looking like an onion? Turn that upside down. That is an onion. Jolly good show. Jolly good show. Jolly good show. Oh, I remember he used to say yeah. that all the time. In the show. We've been working hard lately, Benson. I know you boys have. That's why I want to. I'm so sorry. This one's making trip. you uncomfortable. It's making me very uncomfortable. Jolly, jolly good show. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, Pops Go knows on. what's up. Go on and get yourself one. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna skip to the end. I don't like this. He eats the go. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. All right. I can't. I can't watch any more of that one. That one's really disturbing. Is that Tommy in it? <laughs> no. Is it? Is that meant to be Tommy in it? <coughs> Anyways, guys, I'm done with this. I just wanted to uh, do a little short video today on uh, just reacting to some fun little animations. So if you guys would like to go watch these yourself, they will be linked in the description below. Or just come check out Meat Canyon's channel. Make some amazing animations. And shout out to Horror Shorts Party. Make some other awesome animations. Love them. Uh, I'd say I'd like Meat Canyon's better though because he's more like trendy with it. Like he's got like regular show Peppa Pig, the baby, Tommy in it. I like that. Uh, Spongebob Goku, oh my god. Yeah guys, if you would like me to react to any animations, you know what to do. Comment it down below, like for more, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed, because you know we are halfway through 950. We are getting very close to 1,000 subscribers, so if you would go do that for me, I would be very, very grateful. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys all really enjoyed this 
reaction video. <laughs> Bit different for me, you know, don't do these a lot because obviously I know you guys love the Friday Night Funkings. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next one. I'm out.